Video this morning showing the moment a train and car collided in the South Bay, killing two people inside. KPX 5's Jackie Ward is following the investigation in San Jose. Jackie. VTA crews were here until about 5.30 this morning working on any repairs that happened here because of the damage yesterday from that fatal crash. They had to repair an overhead pole and some of the rails, but they worked so quickly and efficiently that service today shouldn't be impacted too badly for all of those commuters. Witnesses say around 12.30 yesterday afternoon, it seemed like the driver of a gold Buick Regal was trying to cross the tracks at Lincoln and Osiree Avenues before Winchester Mountain View VTA train passed through. The the car wasn't fast enough and the train plowed into the side of the car, killing both the driver and the passenger inside the vehicle. There were about 20 people on board the train and they are all OK. The train operator was taken to the hospital as a precaution. People who heard what happened said it was hard to decipher what was going on at first. I felt the shaking. I heard the rumbling and then, you know, you hear a crash. I feel for these people's families and their loved ones and their friends. As of 5 this morning, the VTA says there is no need for bus bridges to take rail passengers around this intersection. In fact, we've already seen several trains drive slowly through this area this morning. The VTA says trains will travel five miles per hour through the area, which may delay the schedule a bit, but trains will be running as normally as possible. San Jose police are taking over this investigation and they have not released the names of the two people who died yet. In San Jose, Jackie Ward, KPIX 5.